Hi guys, we are going to talk about counting by tens. So the first thing we're gonna do is count by ones all the way to 10. Ready, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. All right, so we have 10 blocks. So if someone said, how big is that group of blocks? Instead of saying, well, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, 10, we could just say, oh, 10 blocks, because we know there's 10 blocks. So when we count with a group of 10, it makes it really fast to count our groups and our blocks. Ready? Here we go. 10. Well, do we still have 10 blocks? We sure do, but we counted them as a whole group. So all we had to do was say 10. Okay, so next let's go to 20. Ready? 10, 20. Well, that was quick. Do we still have 20 blocks? Yeah, we sure do. We just counted them in groups of 10. Let's look at our hundreds chart because we can do this on here and see how fast we can get to 100 when we count by groups of 10. First, we're gonna check and make sure that our dots are a group of 10. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Okay, so there's 10 dots. So that's our group of 10. We're gonna count groups of 10. Ready? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. When we're counting by tens, we only say the numbers that end in zero. Look how fast we're counting. Let's keep going, ready? 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. We did it, we got all the way to 100 so fast by counting by tens. So we're counting our blocks in groups of 10 instead of one at a time. Let's count to 100 one more time. Ready? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. So fast. So good, you guys. 100. Great job counting by tens, you guys. Okay, now you can practice at home. You can do groups of 10 fingers, do high tens or you could do groups of 10 Cheerios, or you could do groups of 10 Legos, okay? So have your families help you find things that you can use to practice counting by tens. If you need to use the hundreds chart to help you, that is awesome, but practice counting by tens. Great job, you guys.